Hey there, Tristan here, and welcome to Anchored. If you could do anything in life knowing it would be successful, what would you do? Would you start a business, ask someone out on a date, travel the world? What about sharing your faith? If you knew that anything you said or did with God's power would be unstoppable, how would that change the way you share your faith in Jesus? In this week's message, we heard how the book of Acts wraps up and it ends in a unique way with Paul still in the custody of the Romans, but he's able to preach the gospel freely in Rome to those around him. Acts 28 verses 23 and 24 highlight this. After arranging a day with him, many came to him at his lodging. From dawn to dusk, he expounded and testified about the kingdom of God. He tried to persuade them about Jesus from both the law of Moses and the prophets. Some were persuaded by what he said, but others did not believe. Look at how Paul was able to focus on one thing, sharing the gospel with as many people as possible. He is unable to leave his living space, but he takes the opportunity to share with the men and women who are around him. Paul is taking every chance God gives him, every season, to share God's love. In recent years, I've had some opportunities to use my gifts as a filmmaker to travel and meet lots of people. I've had times where I've been the only Christian in the room. There were times when conversations about God were able to happen, and other times where it didn't. Looking back, I feel I was not as bold as I should have been. Can you relate? One thing that is helpful, though, is that we can seek God for more boldness, and we can definitely pay attention to the season God has us in and how he has uniquely positioned us to reach certain people. Paul serves the same God that we do. We know that when we follow God and we're obedient, we'll be able, uh, successful and able to share the gospel with others, and we leave the rest up to him. I'll end with a few questions that you can ask yourself. What does your ministering or outreach to non-believers look like right now? And what could it look like with more boldness from God? What can you do this week to take a step towards boldness and embrace being sent with the power of God?